What is up guys and girls, I am Virtual Pix and welcome to Oxygen Not Included. Oh, I've actually been wanting to play this game and finally got around to actually getting it. I um, found it on Steam. Um, not entirely certain if I'll be able to put the link in the description for this one because it was a bit of a bitch to find. Considering that the uh, one that popped up on the Steam actual interface on my computer wasn't the one that I actually had to buy it from. Well done, Steam. You cocked it up. Oh well. Without further ado, let's actually get started on this, shall we? Mm, for those of you who have noticed, yes, it is rather dark in the background. I have been recording for a very long time today. Uh, right, so. I have absolutely. I do kind of know a little bit about this game. It's not completely blind, but it's blind for the most part. I don't know most of the controls. I don't really know what things are good and what things are bad. So. There we go. With that being said, let's uh, pick what's going on here. Uh, what have we got? Four athletics, nine creativity. I'm gonna assume that that's a good thing. Uh, irritable bell. Ooh. Angel destructive when stressed. Yeah, I think we'll be changing you. Mm, changing you too. A grease monkey, you're a biohazard, you've got 5 tinkering, 4 creativity, and you're a vomiter when you're stressed. Okay, well, that's, uh, good. Um, not so sure what's going on with the, uh, pose there, but fair enough. Let's see, what have we got? 4 learning, 4 strength, uh, you're ambitious, uh, flatulence, and you're destructive when stressed. Um, no thank you. One medicine, two athletics, two construction, two strength. Uh, scaredy cat, diver's lungs, and you're just, you know, even though you're destructive when you're stressed, I think we can deal with that because you've got some pretty good all round traits. So, what have you got? You've already got two bad things, and you're a slow learner. No, thank you. Yeah, seven cooking, five creativity, three tinkering. Interior decorator. You're a vomiter when you're stressed and you're a yokel. Don't know what that means. But screw it. Yeah, I think we're going to keep all your names as well. Let's see, what sort of uh, random ones have we got? Um, okay. Crash pad. Yeah, that, that, that suits me down to a T. That kind of encapsulates just me in general, I think. Oh, Gidoki. Right, so what are we doing here? Alert, your crew is awoken whilst beneath the surface of a lump near your terrestrial body. Oddly, they have no recollection now they got there. Might be best to start digging. Okie Why well, I instantly found the pause button, which is one of my first things to do in these sorts of games. When there's a lot of management to be done, I can now actually take in the UI without a bunch of shit going on at once. Uh, oh, okay. So we got oxygen, we've got different overlays. Really lovely, I think I'll probably priority overlay decor. Gas. Okay, we've got a light overlay as well. Sweet, okay. Temperature overlay. Ah. Now I'm gonna guess that that might actually be, um. Chilled. Why is that bit chilled but this bit isn't? Interesting. Anyway, moving on. Let's see, I'm gonna guess that selecting... No, okay. <laughs> I should probably let the game 
tell me the basic controls. Uh, use the WASD keys to pan. Mouse will to zoom in or out. Lovely. Uh, space will resume your game. I already figured that much out. Thank you. Next one is different. So uh, generally self motivated. You do not need to be individually most in order to perform tasks in the colony. Uh, you can use the dig tool G and the build menu in the lower left of the screen to begin planning job tasks once you have a few place duplicates or uh, once you have a few place your duplicates will automatically get to work for you. Lawfully! Okie dokie then, right so I'm not gonna dig that far over that because that looks like it could be terrible. Just a, uh, you know, on a whim, that's what is that? That's sand. So yeah, on a whim, I'm gonna guess that that might. If I dig this, that's gonna fall through, and then the water's gonna come through. Oh, Kidoki then. Right. So we don't need to worry about that. So. Uh, you lot can get to work, start doing that. Um, actually, where is the, the builders on the lower left? I don't see the build menu. Or is this actually... No, that's... I believe this might actually be... Yeah. Oh, okay. Well, fair enough. Because um, I kind of want to make that room in its own right, so let's get rid of that. You know, I don't like how that's uneven, so we're going to get rid of that as well. Uh, you know what? Might actually be an idea to just dig into that in general, mightn't it? Yeah, let's do that. Let's dig into that in general there we go what is that cultivatable soil ooh interesting I have absolutely zero clue if I'm actually doing any good here or not but fair enough uh, ooh material Okay, I can't actually place you. Storage compactor, I guess you'll probably be handy, so we'll sh shove some of you down. Because, YOLO. Duplicate movement. Uh, duplicates uh, must have accessible paths to their jobs. Uh, job tiles in order to work. When placing tiles, keep in mind the difference can only climb obstacles two tiles high and are themselves two tiles tall. If you're unsure of the tiles placed accessible, select blueprint and click show navigation to view the areas which you can reach. Ah. You're not going to be able to reach that, are you? Hello. Oh, storage. Oh, okay. Um. Okay, just store everything for now, because that's pretty much why I put you there. Uh, I need raw metal. Do I even have raw metal? Need copper ore. Coal. Huh, what's, what the hell is this? Contaminated water. Contaminated oxygen. Okie dokie. I should probably bring up my auction of and make sure things are um Aha. I'm seeing a bit of fluctuation which um I might want to get on top of sooner rather than later. You're not accessible, are you? I bet you that's not accessible. Uh, mm, not too much of a problem. Um, I 
Uh, how do I cancel you? Like that, that's hell. Get rid of that. There we go, right. So you now should be able to reach that. See, using my noggin. Create a platform in which they can climb on to uh, dig out that little bit for me. And once you've done that. Oh, you can't. Oh, well, we can select you to deconstruct at the very least. Fair enough. Let's do that. Let's uh, deconstruct all of this because we don't need it anymore. Bring you down. Shove a door on you. I don't know what the fuck we're going to do with that room, but we're going to do something with it. Right, so let's pause it quickly because I've done a lot and I'm not entirely certain what the fuck I've actually created here. I know I've created something, but I have no idea what. Right, so, okay, uh, becomes idle when the room enters maximum pressure range. Converts algae into oxygen. Okie dokie then. Power. Manual generator. Tiny battery and an electrical wire. Okay, so that's what we've got for that. Uh, Russian box. Uh, micro mushers. <laughs> Probably shove one of those down. That might actually be an idea, mightn't it? Um, Tira, let's shove you down. Obviously, you're going to need power, so I guess shove you there. How much do you take up? Ooh, I can actually provide a battery for it as well, because I'm hoping that with that battery, I'll just be able to run a few things off of it and have it. Yeah, as a backup supply. You can tell I played these kind of games before. Oh god. Um medical cart stations. Ooh. Okay. I'm gonna presume that that's quite a handy thing to have, so you can go there. Um Floor ramp. <laughs> okay, because I got no room in there to put one. Um, I guess we'll put one there. Right, off you go. You can start. Oh, do you know what? Silly me, I didn't even bother to um. Insufficient materials? What do I need for this? I need raw metal for that? Oh well. We are plenty of that over here. There we go. <laughs> Problem solved. Yes, I, I'm quite well aware that this is going to be an issue. You're not going to build, are you? Ah. Didn't mean to put that there. I meant to put that there, and then we can. Do you know, what? I might actually just leave that there, because then I can have that as a kind of way to get up here, probably. I guess. Now, like I said, I've got no freaking idea what I'm doing. That, and then across here to you two. There we go. I know it's not the prettiest looking thing, but screw it. Um, let's have a look. What have we got here? Ingredients: dirt and bottled water, meal lice and bottled water. Hmm. Uh, 
Okay, well, we'll come back to that. I don't. We've got a ration box and we haven't used it yet, so I don't suppose that would be a problem. Uh, battery threshold. Actually, no, we'll have the battery threshold set at 50. You know, I should probably actually look at my priority over like that would make sense. You. No. You. Right. How do I up your priority? Uh, let's up you to a 7. Actually, no, we'll up you to a 6. Uh. Yeah, and I'll leave everything else for a 5. That way, at least I've got power being sorted. Should probably up you to a six as well, that might be um sensible. Um research station. And like how do you fabricate? No power. Well, yeah, no shit there's no power. They haven't finished building the wires to it yet. They're doing it bloody fast though, Jesus. Uh Select a research. I'm gonna go for that, I think, first. It seems like it might be the most important one. I get the feeling maybe digging all this out wasn't necessary. Uh, it's fine, I guess. Uh, very breathable. Um, Aha! Okay, this is going to cause a problem, isn't it? Yep, that does look like Mike was robbing the power grid. Well, at least that battery's doing its job. How's the temperature overlay there? You lot have just gone to sleep. Fair enough. So you're warm, that's not a surprise. I mean you've got a manual generator, the battery and the micro mushroom in there. You've got a lot of stuff going on. Overall our um temperature doesn't seem to be doing too bad. Could be worse. Huh. Well, I do believe we might actually be doing well. I might actually, it does look like I'm actually not doing too badly. Don't know what I'm going to do with this area though. Hmm. It is an interesting idea. Do you know what? I am. Feeling like maybe I should reach down into this area, see what's going on here. Okay, oxygen overlay. Yeah, I can definitely see that that's going to be causing a problem. Um, oh, what's this one? What's this button do? What have we got here? Okay, you can't do combat at all, at all fair enough. Um, take you away. Uh, do you know what? I get... Ah, oh, okay. I should probably sort that out at some point. I'm just going to leave that as is because I'm not where anyone's particularly good for that right now. Um, yeah, we'll leave you two doing that, I think. So, you're pretty much just doing the general bits, I hope. 
Right. Ho. Hmm. I'm not entirely certain what the hell I'm doing here. But I get the feeling that I'm doing something kind of not good. Screw it. We'll, um... Shove that down there. I know that one's probably in light, so... Could be better. But oh well. No fabrication's queued. Oh, there we go then. Let's sort that out. Hopefully. Um. <laughs> also, I noticed. Ah, okay. So that is what we need. Mm, harvest. Dig up. And oh, your harvest was well, so I'm gonna leave you alone. Oh, Kidoki, then wasn't expecting that. Yes, yeah, so I kind of know that these things are um, contaminated water. Contaminated water is a mix of contaminated oxygen, can cause seizing of duplicates. Small accidents can be cleaned up by clicking drag with the mop tool. There's a mop tool? There is a mop tool. Okay, so now we just have to deal with the um, skill increased. What have you got wrong with you? Nothing. You're just recharging that battery, are you? Fair enough. So now I'm beginning to wonder if maybe... You know, for the sake of oxygen actually flowing around properly, oh lovely! I have um. Oh shit! I just realised that there was one that I missed. There we go. Right. At least, hopefully, with those little holes, the oxygen can um. Flow around a bit more efficiently. Mentally, it doesn't actually seem to be doing all that bad right now. It's just this little corner over here is um, producing a little bit of a problem. You can't reach that. Uh, that's fine. We'll cancel the dig on that. There we go. Right, you can sweep all that up, get all that sorted for me. Ooh, what are you? Vacuum, unbreathable. Be sure to stay away from that then. There's a lot of water around here. Hydrogen, chlorine, contaminated water. Right. How's my old oxygen overlay doing? Jesus, it's still not doing very well, is it? Okie dokie then. Um, hmm. I wonder. Um, base. There we go. You can have a little thing there, because I'm going to assume that water will probably be a uh, 
priority relatively soon. Oh, at least everything seems to be going okay, kind of, I think. I actually have no idea. What the fuck? Wait, is that... Oh, do you know what? It's a bloody good job that I didn't go into that, because I didn't realise that's a vacuum. Which would have sucked all my oxygen right out, wouldn't it? Ooh. Okay, then. That's, uh... That was an interesting one. Right, what is this door? What does it actually stop? So, um, closed room blocking the flow of gas or liquid. Will that work? I see no reason for it not to. Um. Oh shit, I didn't realise there was a dig thing there. Oopsie. Actually, do you know... Can I just set you to continue? I can. I can just set you to continuous. Lovely. How in the holy hell did you manage to build that tile there when you've not even broken into the area yet? What even? Um, what the hell is this? You seem to have uh, slightly cocked up a little bit there. Well, this is going to cause an infinite problem. Hmm. Are you eating my resources? You are, aren't you? You are eating my resources. Yeah, that's it. You do whatever it is you're doing with him. Keep attacking him. Um, if he doesn't keep running away like a little bitch. There we go, right. Uh, building flooded. I know that it's flooded, that's um... Quite the observation you've made there. If you could, like, maybe priority overlay. Do you think you could get that built? Like, relatively fast? Thank you. Now, I'm hoping that this will just... That's gonna flood, isn't it? Yeah, that's gonna flood. Oh, good okay then. Right, cancel that. Cancel. No. Let's, um... Deal with this. I'm gonna have to go about this another way, because... This is going to be a bit of a problem. I wonder, can we actually mop this up? Is that even possible? Hopefully it's possible. Why are you going down there? 
Ah, oh, you're getting rid of that. Okay, that's kind of weird. Why did that happen? Do you know what? I'm not going to question how you lot have not been electrocuted in a room filled with water when there's a battery sparking electric everywhere. Not a clue. Anyway, how's my um, oxygen overlay doing not very well? What the fuck is going on up there? I don't even know. Uh, power grid, obviously it's fine. Temperature overlay. Meh. Not too bad, I guess. Well, they appeared to be kind of solving the problem. I guess. If you can call that solving the problem. Okie dokie, right, so... That's that crisis averted. Kind of managed to deal with that. Um, oxygen. I should probably actually drop one of you in there, shouldn't I? It might be an idea. Just a little thought, you know. We do seem to have more than enough material for it, so. You're full. Okay then. I'm hoping that I've actually. But actually, do I even have. Okay. I don't even know. Mill one seed sounds like. Oh, I do actually have algae. Lovely. Well, admittedly, it looks a bit of a mess, but I think we are um, actually not doing all too bad. Bit of a knowledge of uh, basics behind management games is essential, though. I'm glad that I was right about this sand just kind of vaporizing the minute I did go below it. Admittedly, I should have had the foresight to maybe more appropriately solve that, but oh well. Oh, you need power. There we go. Well. And insufficient resources. And then, let me guess, you're going to shove it in there? Is that the cut? No. Literally all just gonna sweep. Is that that is that what's gonna go on? Oh, dokie, right. You, your, uh, your uh, priority. You don't even have a priority. Oh, dokie, then. No, I suppose I can move the um. I'll go from you, can I? Oh. Okay, we get another guy. You, <laughs> definitely. I've been taking you, thank you. There we go. I really don't have any algae. I have algae right there, so... I guess we'll be digging that. And that, apparently, 
just have that ladder in there and we are going to leave it like that with those things planned because we are all out of time for this video in fact i've actually run home for like quite a bit so yeah. but thank you for watching if you like this video hit that like button stay awesome as always and i will see you lot in the next video